We have just checked in here to our hotel, which is the Anatara Tangal. And just at the entranceway, we were all presented with these beautiful flowers. Oh my God, this smells so good. I'm actually gonna keep this in my room. What a nice welcome to the hotel. Thank you so much. Okay, this place is so cool. There's like this mini shallow pool uh, right in the bar. So the bar like wraps its way around this tiny little pool. And you can just sit in here with your beers. Like so. Like so. Like Ali is demonstrating. Oh, yes, <laughs> it's chilly. It's quite cool in the <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> and how to say cheers in Sri Lankan. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> This is the breakfast here at the Anatara. Even have their own juice station. So all these different types of fresh fruits. And then you can pick what raw juice you would like for breakfast. You can see them all there. They also have lots of different types of fresh jams. Uh, a whole bread section. So you've got fresh bread, you've got muffins, you've got croissants. All of these little pastries. I go to the waffle station. You've got different types of syrups and jams, and you've got pureed strawberry. You've got pineapple, and then they've got uh, waffles and pancakes, which they can make to order. And then you've got traditional stuff as well. So we've got poppers. Uh, egg hoppers, the plain hoppers. I'm Han Madam. Hi, everyone. This is our departure. Please see. Touch the glass. Touch it? May God bless you. Uh, wish you a safe and happy journey. I'm looking forward to see you soon. Thank you. I wanted to make a video for you guys to show you some of the top places to visit on the south coast of Sri Lanka. So starting in Colombo and making your way all the way down to Tangal, there are a lot of amazing places to stop off along the way. So even if you're driving straight the whole way um, in one day, you can stop off at various places along the coast that are worth a photo spot or worth looking around or worth stopping for lunch. Now our first stop here between Tangal and Colombo is Coconut Tree Hill. You will see a sign on the road that says Coconut Hill Tree. Coconut Tree Hill. Um, and it's just a little photo spot. It's right at the, never eat, try to reach. It's right at the western side of Tangal Beach. I mean, Marissa Beach. It's right on the western side of Marissa Beach. And you have to hike up to the top. And there are all these amazing, tall, beautiful palm trees.
hangs off a palm tree about halfway down the beach and people love to swing off it and get epic photos. Now you do have to pay the locals some rupees, some rupiah to go on the swing, but it's definitely worth it. It's super fun and you get some great shots. Stop is the gorgeous and very historic town of Gaul. Uh, you can see Gaul Lighthouse here behind us. Uh, that's one of the most iconic buildings here in Gaul. So if you're going from Colombo to San Gaul, most people would actually stop off in Gaul for a few nights. There's some really cute boutique hotels, nice restaurants, and it's really nice just to walk around, enjoy the sunset, check out the fort, check out the lighthouse. Now we just have an hour here, so we're gonna see how much we can fit in in one hour. 